my friend Anna and I embarked on a big adventure and a bucket list trip, an eight-day tour through the highest region on Earth, the Tibet Autonomous Region. We were one of the first groups of foreigners allowed into the area in quite a while, so we were especially excited to come visit and see the beauty that this part of the country has to offer. Our tour guides welcomed us with a kata, which is a Tibetan ceremonial scarf that symbolizes purity and compassion. It is traditionally given as a gift at all sorts of ceremonial occasions, and today it was given to us as a welcome with a wish of good luck as we started on our journey. for the next eight days. Today we're going to explore the city of Lhasa and that's all. Tibetan dress, which was one of my favorite things to see. Our tour guide just let us know. So right now we're not even in Lhasa and once we enter inside we will be. the Jokhang Temple is known as the spiritual heart of the city and the oldest part of the temple was built in the year 652. It was not permitted to film inside of the temple but the exterior of what you're seeing now was equally as beautiful. 
I loved looking at the intricacy of the paintings displayed on the archways and the doors as we walked through and pointing out the different patterns at each location. Next, we headed to a lookout where you can see the same view of the Potala Palace as the picture on the 50 yuan banknote. There's quite a few of these pictures on the various notes and I'm hoping to collect all of them as I travel through China. After that, we ventured to a park located just behind the palace for an afternoon boat ride. Mm-hmm. <laughs>